Welcome to Boston. Mike bringing up the TD Garden for one of the marquee games on the NBA schedule. The East leading Miami Heat with their new loaded lineup of stars visiting the defending conference champion Celtics and their own contingent of all NBA performers. Time. Relentless. Unforgiving. Defining. In Miami, the time is now to rise and fulfill a dream. In trouble. For the veteran Celtics, time is of the essence. A window closing with each passing day. Now hard and puts it in. Seems like it could be Kobe time. For the Lakers, time to rekindle their championship form and overcome doubts. Best in show, Dwight Howard. In Orlando, time for new pieces to gel and emerge stronger, wiser, better. Whose time has arrived today when four title contenders take the floor? Heat, Celtics, Lakers, Magic. Next on ABC, home of the NBA Finals. Today, LeBron James and the Miami Heat looking down on the rest of the East, a half a game lead over Boston and the Heat with something to prove. Two early season losses to the Celtics want to show that now they are good enough to beat the defending Eastern Conference champ. Dwayne Wade and the Heat have played the second easiest schedule in the NBA so far. Their opponents have only a 46.6 win percentage. Only the Atlanta Hawks have had it easier. You know who doesn't have it easy today? JB and Wilbon. They're about to make some hard choices between the top two powers in the Eastern Conference. Hey man, listen up, man. Um, it's, a, it's a good test for us. You know, this, this game right here doesn't define our season, but it definitely can help our season, man, knowing that we can play for some of these bigger teams, man. We know we're a league team. This team got a lot of experience over us, and they got a lot of uh, other things over us, man. So we got to come out and we got to dominate both ends, offensively and defensively. If they make a shot, don't worry about it. We got to get it out and we got to execute on both ends, man. All right? Let's attack them all night long, man, or all day long. Here we go. Dominate on three. One, two, three. Dominate. Heat and the Celtics with a sellout crowd in Boston. The NBA doesn't get much better than this. What are the necessary ingredients for a championship? Talent, chemistry. Those two components bonded beautifully in 2008 when three veteran stars united in Boston. Those Celtics conducted a clinic on teamwork. A strong start continued straight to a title and another banner for the league's winningest franchise. This season, a new collection of stars are fighting for the NBA's ultimate prize. LeBron James and Chris Bosh have joined Dwayne Wade in Miami. With soaring expectations, the new look heat have battled critics and injuries. Yet today, find themselves sitting atop the Eastern Conference. Right behind them, the veterans from Boston. Despite injuries of their own, they just continue to win, looking towards June, led by their young star. Miami's talent is unquestionable, their potential unlimited, but can they come together and perfect that championship formula? It's one of the most anticipated games of this NBA season. The two beasts of the East will meet for the third time. And just moments ago here in Boston, a standing ovation for Ray Allen. He gets the ball that he hit the historic three-pointer with as he passed Reggie Miller Thursday night to become the NBA's all-time leader in three-point field goals. But history's over. It's time for a new game. 